What I, one of the things I like about the uh, the newer machines, the ones that we offer, are there. You can get a fairly inexpensive uh, machine, which will do a great job and give you lots of alkaline water. Oh my gosh! Yeah, I mean, a lot of people who uh, you know think that uh, an alkaline water machine is expensive. Uh, you really just you know need to do the math. I I just in five minutes or less can figure out. Uh, you divide the cost of the machine by 365 days and divide it again by five years, which is just your out warranty period. And um, for, you know, let's say a, a more expensive than average machine would be $1,800, I would say. Because this machine was $875, um, and it's perfectly adequate machine for a normal size family, but right. you know some people will spend you know eighteen nineteen hundred on a machine. It's well worth it. But what I'm the bottom line there is if you do that math and divide it by that many days in a year and that many years, it comes up to maybe less than fifty cents a day. <laughs> well, I mean that's just for five years. But if you yeah. multiply that by two or three times, oh yeah, these machines. I mean you're looking yeah. at you know, hardly oh, virtual, no cost. Pennies. And look, look at what people are doing. They're buying water in bottles at the store like crazy. Which are not alkaline. Oh, yeah, you know, that's one of the things on my list here. Why should you not buy water from in bottles <laughs> at the store? It's, it's not alkaline. You're right. A lot of times, it's not even neutral pH. Sometimes <laughs> it's acidic. Yeah. Sometimes the water you buy in these bottles, I, I've tested them and you can see on our website we've got tests and lots of tests all over the internet. Um, there's just no bottled water that's any good as far as alkalinity goes.